Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Emma and I make art videos. In today's video, I'm going to be drawing a portrait of the Australian vegan activist, James Aspie. Here is a quick preview. You can't really see it too well because of the glare, but um, if you'd like to see me make this piece, keep on watching. Before I go in with any solid details, I want to make sure that I've got my proportions right and for this part I want to use a very light hand. I don't want to be putting down any dark lines just in case I do need to erase them. Once my basic lines are down and I'm relatively happy with how they look, I then go in with more detail, but I'm still using a relatively light hand just because I might need to fix things up. Um, I still don't want to just go in with too much detail straight away. I want to go in with a light hand with all of the detail that I need and then when I know I'm happy with it, then I can go in and darken up the areas. You'll notice that I had to actually fix up the left eye because it was too high and I didn't realize that earlier on. At this point, the head looks quite flat, so I am going in and shading in where the shadows are. I'm still using a light hand though, just in case I still need to erase these areas, but this is going to give me a better idea of what the contrast looks like. Once I'm happy with the proportions, I then go in with a darker pencil just to darken up all of the areas. Earlier on, I was using an HB pencil and for the darker areas, I'm using a 2B pencil. And for this part, because I have everything where I want it to be, it's really a matter of just kind of darkening the areas that I have. There are some areas that I'll need to kind of add more detail to, but this is where you're going to want to be looking at your reference image. You want to make sure that you're drawing exactly what you see, not what you think you see. If you're familiar with my YouTube channel, you'll know that I don't normally draw guys. So one thing that I wasn't so used to uh, drawing with this piece is the facial hair. Everything else um, is relatively similar, you know, eyes, nose, mouth, um, proportions, all of that is going to be similar depending on, you know, if you're drawing a female or a male or a, a non-gender person, you know, it's all similar, it's more so the details that are going to change. So for this, we have facial hair. Um, I don't normally draw facial hair, um, so I, I really just tried to replicate what I saw. And when you're drawing facial hair, you really want to take note of the direction of the hair. And you don't need to draw every individual piece of hair. Um, I found it helpful to kind of you know, kind of shade in the areas that were slightly darker and add strokes, but they don't have to be like each individual hair, if that makes sense.
that is all from me today. Before I show you the finished piece, I do want to remind you all that I am on Patreon. So if you'd like to give me some support over there, you can at patreon.com forward slash mxmarie. And if you'd like to follow my art on Instagram, you can at mxmarieart. Anyway, I think that is all from me today. So thank you for watching. I hope you're all having a fantastic day. And here is the finished piece.